Hey, what's up, guys? Hey, guys. Good morning and welcome back. Yeah. Uh, we're very excited because uh, we finished Fleabag recently. Yeah. R.I.P. and I hope it comes back because it was so good. That finale was perfect. And by the way, guys, we've really enjoyed uh, the discourse surrounding Fleabag on, on Patreon. It's been 100%, a lot of fun talking about yeah. the show because it is a, a very complex show that, like, you know, it, it deserves some conversation. Uh, but we oh, were, it's definitely a talk about it right? show, right? It, yeah. It's got some really good themes. And um, we, we, we decided we wanted to replace it with a show that's equally short kind of not, not not that we're looking for like shortness and length but just you know we have a grid structure going on and uh, a lot of people suggested Barry. the episodes are 30 minutes a piece apparently yeah. and i feel like it's not just a, a cheap show that you can just kind of binge and have no n no conversation about right a lot, a lot um, of people have enjoyed the show and it's obviously done very well at the emmy so yeah yeah check um, it out. We, we we're we're aware of the two obviously primary cast members right you got uh, Stephen Root and, and Bill Hader, obviously. I was thinking Henry Winkler. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's yeah. Uh, he's, he's he's the other Emmy darling on the show. Stephen Root, guys, I don't know if he, he's he's definitely a guy that like he shows up in a lot of stuff. And like, oh, that guy, you know, right? Yeah, he's he's, he's one of those bad guys. Lot, you yeah, know? Um, and I've been a big fan since Office Space, you know. So I I love these news guys. radio for me. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. He was so funny on news radio, but definitely after uh, especially after you know um, what's his name? Oh my God, I'm totally blanking out. Henry Winkler. Hartman. Phil Hartman. Oh, Phil Hartman. Yeah, 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 yeah. After Phil Hartman, and after he left, it really was Stephen Root's show, I feel like, mm -hmm. as far as who's carrying it. Was Andy Dick on that show? Yeah. And jo Joe Rogan, too. And Joe Rogan, Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. Weird, weird show, as far as cast goes. Dave uh, Foley. Dave Foley, yeah. <laughs> but it was it, it was, a, it was a lot of fun. But, uh, but at any rate, um, Bill Hader has obviously gotten a lot of critical and, uh, you know, fan praise for the show. Yes. And um, as has Henry Winkler. I did not realize until it happened, that was his first Emmy. Oh, really? Henry Winkler, who's been a the titan Fox. of television yeah, yeah, for yeah. decades, finally got an Emmy for, for Barry, which is great. So I'm really looking forward to what he to what he does yeah, here. I, you know, growing All up, the shows he's been on, man. He's been on a ton of TV. Arrested Development and he Parks was, and Rec. He was on Arrested Development. God, he's, yeah, yeah, yeah. he's been so good on television for so long. I was a big Adam Sandler fan when I was a kid. Uh, he was he, he shows up randomly in lots of episodes. Right, like the Waterboy. Waterboy was yeah. a big one in my right. house. So I, I've always associated him with that. But as I got older, you know... You get to see his work, and I'm excited to see this because apparently he's fantastic on the show. Right, and also, uh, uh, like myself, big Patrick Mahomes fan. So he's a big Patrick Mahomes. Oh fan? my god, that's hilarious! He went to <laughs> he went to one of the games and met Patrick this year in Kansas City. He's like from Kansas, is he? I don't think so. Okay. He just is really a big Patrick Mahomes fan. Jump on the bandwagon. That's, we'll that's right. We'll take it. <laughs> him, him, him and Paul Rudd. We'll take it. And as far as the show, the premise of the show, I know it's about a hitman who goes to L.A. That's it, uh, and I kind of got like okay. Gross. Actor, I think I think it was gross. It was kind of a gross point blank, blank file. Yeah, that's, he wants yeah, to, he yeah. wants to become an actor, and that's the extent of, of the show. Yeah, that's that's all. But, I mean, right, it's hard not to keep up with. Yeah, we, like that I mean, I've seen I've seen trailers over the years, mostly for the first season. I don't recall trailers for anything after that. But I, I remember last year when the third season aired, it was big everywhere. People were talking about it online, so it's about time we checked it out. Yeah, absolutely. And I know nothing about the seasons about to start. I don't even know if they've done trailers for the for the new season or not. But I know this is the fourth and final one is about yeah. to start. Yeah, it it like and Succession that. are both wrapping up. I like that. I like that. Uh, no one to go. A four season yeah, structure is absolutely. So, um, so we're gonna go ahead and go ahead yeah. and jump into this. Before we do, we do want to welcome some new Patreon subscribers. So Nicholas Reed, Tyler McKenzie, and Brianna J. Thank you so much and welcome. We sincerely, sincerely appreciate yeah. you. Thanks, guys. Thanks for being here. For yeah. those of you watching us on YouTube, welcome to the channel. Uh, Hello. If you don't mind, guys, leave us a comment down below. No spoilers, please. Hit yeah, that please. like button and hit that subscribe button so you guys yeah. keep up to date with us. And for those of you who've done it, thank you. I really, really appreciate it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. If you'd like to check out full reactions to this and their other content, please check out the link to our Patreon in the description below. If you are on YouTube watching this episode of Barry, we're already several episodes ahead over on Patreon, so we that's are. a good way to get caught up. You will need to have your own source material to sync with it. Yeah, that works. Um, so we're obviously watching on HBO Max, so yep. that's a good way to go to watch along with this. All right. Okay. There's our guy. How tall is Bill Hader? I think he's pretty lanky. He's pretty oh my tall. god. <laughs> oh wow. Okay, so So we just killed somebody. This so is dark. So we're twelve seconds in and we've already really got the working hitman thing in. It's already darker than Gross Point Blank. <laughs> no, Gross Point Blank starts with an assassination. It does, but it's yeah. like lighter, you know? Yeah. Because <laughs> like they're because they're playing uh I can see clearly now the yeah. rain is gone. <laughs> yeah, Dan Ackford on the bike. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, that would bug me. I know. If everyone's asleep around you, man, you don't do that. The music is definitely like broken circus music, like really sad. It's like yeah. depressing.
This kind of reminds me of the theme song from Fargo. A little bit, yeah. yeah. So we are in a funk. <laughs> it's a video game, sorry. Not with these extra expenses, they add up. Okay. All right. Wow. wow, that sucks. Two days in a hotel room to kill somebody? Relax. What do you say to a little trip out to sunny Los Angeles? <laughs> you came here to give me an assignment? It's a Chechen mob. Chechen mob? Chechen mob? Beta. Hanging all up Sunday. Well, when do you think that'll be? The plane for LA leaves okay, in four yeah, so hours. Okay, so he's definitely forcing him to car. do this. Why? Because it's cheaper? Or? Because it is smarter, Barry. It's cheaper? Yeah. How much cheaper was it? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, his handler, so his handler sucks. Yeah. I told him you were my best guy, so he should hook you up. He said the car is dope. So. <laughs> the car is dope. Oh, oh fucking, fucking dick. <laughs> <laughs> they do that in LA. Do they? 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 Do. Oh yeah. <laughs> so thirsty, we've got juice boxes, Hawaiian oh. lunch, and maybe beer or something. I would love a juice box. Right? Yeah. Submarine sandwich. Yeah. Watch a Disney Channel. <laughs> Business has been going great. I recognize that Recently, guy. Yeah. He was a joker. One, two, three, two. Two, three minutes? Hmm? Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Turn it off! Right. I wanted to give him the whole... He gets it. You already said they're <laughs> right. picking up in hotel. Why Is show food? <laughs> <laughs> you I can, uh... Do this for you. Um, do you want me to stab him in the nuts? <laughs> yeah, stab one him of them <laughs> is I could stab him in the nut. <laughs> <laughs> I love that it's nut, not yeah. nuts. Yeah, it's like one. Nut. <laughs> yeah. That's cool. Yeah. I like it when they do that kind of stuff in movies, like where you, like, you go get like a package with a gun in it. Yeah, like FedEx to a gun. I love espionage by Man Stone. Oh, yeah. Cool. It's so funny that's Bill Hader. Stefan's doing this, you know? Yeah, right. <laughs> He's a talented man. Hey, man. Comedians make the best actors. They really do. Seriously. They're Historically, yeah. completely, yeah. Fuck you two. Don't you fucking call me lady. Is this Magnolia? It sounds Fuck like Magnolia. Two. The uh, Julianne Moore. Yeah. What are you doing out here? Shit. You've Thanks not seen Magnolia? <laughs> yeah. Don't call me lady. He didn't even do anything. Yeah, he just walked up. Yeah. You fucking asshole. Did she pick Who this? Fuck are you? That's so arrogant. Is like Magnolia? Yeah, I, I, I'm just going to be as good as Julianne Moore in an Oscar-nominated performance. That's a good scene. Yeah. Excuse me. I don't give a shit. Wow. Even your excuses are false. You're up there. You're stinking up my stage, babe. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, he's messing this with her. This yeah. shouldn't even be in this class. Oh, my God. I cannot believe. That is not fair, Gene. Don't think. <laughs> yeah. That's oh, my awesome. God. He got her there emotionally. Manipulated her there. Shame on you. Still not as good as Julianne Moore. That's, I think that's kind of the point. It's like, okay, it was better. Suck my dick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. You know that I had to do that, right? Yeah. <laughs> you know I love you. And she's fine with it? Wow. Yeah. All right. But I'm going to do the scene with him. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. Oh, wow. That's a cool shot, too. Yeah, boy. Grab some egg roll. Oh, they do oh, it's true, true romance. romance. <laughs> now, I know I'm pretty, but I ain't as pretty as a couple of titties. And <laughs> 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 scene. And <laughs> scene. He said in scene in character. I was really hoping he'd do that. He thought it was white boy day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I did the scene from the blind side, you know, the one where Sandy Bullock and Trump's football practice. Oh my this God. team is your family. You protect his blind side. Uh, oh my God. <laughs> Why are they doing all movie monologues and nothing theater right. in a theater class? Right. I wonder if that's like the focus of the class. <laughs> that's, that's like the joke. Nobody's actually from LA. Oh, very. I am though. Remember? <laughs> Nick is from Florida. <laughs> Jermaine's from uh... Denver. Jermaine is, was in uh, Three Billboards outside Ebbing, Missouri. Yeah, he was, wasn't yeah. he? Yeah. Next time, I'm going to play somebody who's alive. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Mm. Oh, my God. Lydia, <laughs> out there job. all by herself. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. How is he supposed to kill this guy if he's, right. like, Body, with hanging out with these people? My name's Barry Berkman. I'm here to kill this guy. He just did know? an acting scene with him. And he just disappears out of nowhere? Yeah. Okay. We'll see if he actually kills him. I don't think he will. She is quite lovely. Yeah. Although, a little conceited, obviously. Li yeah. Block. That's Very terrible. Block. Very block. I don't get it. Yeah, because when I look at you, I think of a block. 
What? <laughs> Can you drive him home? He has like seven DUIs. <laughs> sure. You're gonna drive home the guy that he's gonna supposed to kill. If that's the case, that was super easy. Yeah, just kill, yeah, just do that. Yeah. I'd drive home, sure. Never see you guys again. Yeah. Let me do my thing. You're very generous performer. See you become friends that you're supposed to kill. Yeah. Totally. I think he is. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah. I... They were hugging. <laughs> <laughs> I'm outside. Open up. I got a call from the Chechens. Uh... <laughs> you hugging your victim? <laughs> right. And I end up doing a scene with him from True Romance. Yeah. Yeah. True Romance is a movie. Yeah, yeah, yes yeah, it is. It's LA theaters. I guess all the scenes they do are from movies. That's, that's so how, weird. That's hilarious. Yeah, that's I wonder if that's so true. That's how fake the theaters are. Yeah. Think. You think acting could be your purpose? I don't know. I just, I, I, don't, I, I just feel really oh. motivated. You gotta think this thing through. I mean, you wanna, you wanna go out there and try to burn a guy and have him say, "Hey, there's the guy from the chicken commercial." <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I do commercials. <laughs> He already sounds yeah, like a yeah, like yeah. an LA actor. Yeah. Dying over some wannabe actor. I mean that's fair. Yeah, no. Yeah. It's, it's terrible, but yeah. it's <laughs> this is all you do. Also, he's straight up manipulating Barry. Oh, right completely. Now. He is a gaslighter. Kill the bad guys. Yeah. No, okay. Come on, man. Kind of it kind of makes you wonder how many others were killed for petty reasons who weren't really bad guys, you know? Oh, probably all of them. Right. I mean, he's like getting, trying to get this poor guy who's yeah. obviously searching for something to he yeah. was bidding. Just because he's because he slept with the guy's wife, which is bad, but not something you kill somebody no. over. Well, it goes to show you, don't sleep with somebody's wife because they well, might right. just be a, you, yeah. a, a Chechen mob <laughs> right. mob mobster. Not liking this, is he? No, he is not. Also, if he does go to this class, I wonder what scene he's going to do. It can't be any more ridiculous than Magnolia or True Romance. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe they did that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he did Drexel from True Romance. <laughs> I know I'm pretty. I'm pretty I, <laughs> I would love if he did like Bill Paxton from like True Lies. Oh, yeah, that'd be amazing. <laughs> that would be a great scene. Be hilarious. Do you think I was good enough to be in your class? No, you were bad. No, Barry, I don't. I like the honesty. Yeah. Because acting is truth, and I saw no truth. That's actually so not a bad note. Advice, it's not. This yeah. is not it. You want to know what I'm good at? I'm good at killing people. And uh, these people I take out, like, they're they're bad people. You know, like, they're pieces of shit. Um, uh, I don't agree with that, necessarily. That depressed feelings back, you know? Oh my god. He's killing us. Yeah. Like, maybe this is all I'm good at. I don't know. Bill Hader's got some real chops he as does. a dramatic performer, doesn't he? Where's that from? <laughs> oh, he thinks he's doing a scene? <laughs> His life, what? yeah. The story's nonsense, but there's something wrong. <laughs> oh my That's god. Funny. We start on time. Absolutely. What's your last name again? Block. Say block. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> That's a terrible name. It's better than using his real name, I guess. I guess. He's a hitman. He already yeah. said his name was Barry. I guess they forgot his name. Right. No one was listening. Yeah. I, I was wondering how the hell he was going to get away with saying that. Right. And they're just like, oh, it's an act. You're acting. Everything here is fake. Yeah. Right. Oh, wow, okay. He's gonna, it looks like he's gonna do it. I mean, it did open up with him shooting somebody in the head, so I mean, alright. I guess he could kill him and still be in the acting class, just Ryan doesn't show up anymore. Yeah. I'm curious about it. Is he gonna be, like, doing multiple murders throughout the show? It's gotta be, right? <laughs> like, if he's, if that's how he's still getting paid. A hitman moonlighting as an actor. Right. Or vice versa, I guess. Oh. Oh, the Chechens did it. Wow! Whoa. Yo! That was sick! Barry's got the chops. Whole clip fast, yeah. That's honestly, that's really impressive, honestly. It's realistic, too. Yeah. You can tell he definitely did some training. Yeah, oh yeah. Leaving the car, breaking the gun apart. Just smoked those dudes. Did Whew. he kill the whole Hank? I like Noho Hank. The bald guy? Yeah. I mean, it looks like it. Yeah. Was he in the car? I didn't see him. I don't know. Maybe. No, he was in the, he was, he was okay. in the car. No, I think he's... He was one of the three. Yeah. I think he's No Mo Hank. <laughs> hmm. I don't know what's going on over there. <laughs> you have whiskey? There's four dead bodies no. laying in that. They have herbal tea. Yeah. What do you got there? Oh, I've got an audition tomorrow. <laughs> I'm an actor. Oh, is that Kate Bakuchi from Saturday Night Live? 
Is it? I think so. Oh, look at that. I'm an actor, too. Everybody's an actor at LA. That's the, that's right. the ongoing Everyone's thing. got a script or everyone's an actor. Yeah. Yeah, just... Okay, yeah, he's gonna he's gonna sit here and have copy right by the the crime scene. Is that smart? <laughs> That's good writing. I, it is good writing. Oh, Bill Hader directed that. Oh, and he wrote it. Uh, and he created it. Okay, cool. Oh, well, I think I knew he created it. But yeah, I knew he created it. I see. He directed that. But... Wow, wow, that was what an intro. What a what an opening. Yeah, episode. what a way to yeah way to introduce the character in the story. I I I do like. Um, it's funny. It's really funny that um, the L.A. theater. Is doing doing movie all, scenes, all, the small, all movie scenes, yeah, that's pretty funny. Shows how BS, like, right? Are we, are we doing Tennessee Williams? No, we're doing Paul Thomas Anderson. <laughs> we're doing Quentin Tarantino. <laughs> I, I think it's, I think it's like a known fact. Like, if you want to be like a stage actor, you go to New York. Right, you know, right. That's the, in LA. You yeah, that, I mean? that's so, that's kind of the stereotype, isn't it? It's it's, like, it's, I would, right. It kind of shows how conceited and full of themselves people in LA are. I'm not going to be a commercial actor. I'm going to be a, a movie actor. He's I mean? definitely making fun of that that mindset for sure. Yeah. Um, um, and he, obviously, Bill Hader spent lots of time in New York for Saturday Night Live. Right, right, yeah. Um, Fuchs, uh, Stephen Root, kind of taking a, a dark, dark turn here. Um, hey, he's done it before. I think in No Country he played that businessman. Yeah, yeah, he yeah, did. So he, right, he, he right. Did that before. Um, he's he's but, he's got what levels to him for sure. But he's manipulating Barry. Oh, completely. Also, wow, we kind of just everything that happened. I kind of forgot that. Like, okay, so now Barry's got a situation with the Chechens. I take it. Well, he just attacked him. Yeah, he I think this could be a Chechen Chechens. issue. I didn't even think about it, but yeah, there's going to be an issue probably Not with that. Not getting paid for killing that guy and right. killed three of their men. So you're going to hang out in L.A. and deal with the Chechens now? Yeah, he's going to be he's going to be a, an acting student slash a target of the Chechen mob. That is really very much like uh, Gross Point. Gross oh, point completely. Blank, so. Very, close, very, very Gross Point blank. I did think, you know, it was really funny and it's definitely a comedy show. But it's one. There's some definitely some really heavy stuff, some dramatic comedy. scenes. You're very dark, yeah. and they're not shying away from violence at no. all. No, it opened up with a pretty violent scene. Yeah, it, it opened up with a with a, with a murder victim, and then ends with four people getting shot. I so yeah, like the way they shot that too was very cool. It kind of reminded me, not I don't want to say Coen Brothers, but like the way they shot it, kind of it felt that way a little sure. bit. Uh, like I said in the opening, the opening kind of felt, felt like Fargo with the music and the right. snow. But this is different. It, this is like a way different vibe to it. Well, I felt like the, the shooting there at the pickup in the end, it kind of felt like that uh, the hotel scene in No Country for Old yeah, Men, the night, kinda, the night scene. Yeah, with, that's, uh, that's kind of yeah. what it reminded me of. Um, obviously, the, the, the scene didn't play out the same. Oh, no, no, not at all. Not at all. But but it looked a lot. It had a lot of the same look and feel to it. It's um, from a distance. It, it was lit the same. It was yeah. all shot. Was, there was a lot of wide shot to it. Everything happens from a distance. Right, like, yeah. Know, it's a more realistic portrayal of violence, I guess. Um, yeah, it, yeah. that was that was really cool. I don't think I've seen anything with, like, comedy like this. Because it's, it's not slapstick, but it's, it's very funny, very right. well written. Mixed with violence that's done realistically because even yeah. like gross point blank like the actions like it's kind of silly it, it is kind of silly you know but there's some silly uh, and i love gross point blank i do too it's a great movie great soundtrack too one of the best soundtracks <laughs> really ever. one of the best soundtracks um but yeah this is this is really cool i've never yeah. really seen anything like this i mean coen brothers do that in their films they have a lot of humor but at sure. the same time i wouldn't call them comedies per se right i'm kind of wondering moving forward because we didn't see much of it here um, but we obviously know Henry Winkler is going to be a big part of the show. He won. He won supporting Emmys for it, at least one um, that I know of. But uh, how much time we're we going to spend in the acting class with him versus Barry's life yeah. as a hitman or whatever with Fuchs and stuff outside? Because we've, we've really got two worlds to follow here now. Sure. Barry the actor and Barry the Barry the hitman. <laughs> what a ridiculous premise! It is you know, right. There's a little bit of Travis Bickle there too. I feel like you think so. A little bit. Well, yeah. the way he was looking at Sally, uh huh, uh huh. The way he was looking at her in the dance. That's board, true. Right. Kind of felt like Bickle. And then at the very end, when he was talking to Cousineau about I'm not sleeping. You know right. I mean? Which, That's true. By the way, killer monologue. Hater crushed that. You know, absolutely crushed that scene. Um, yeah, I can see why he's winning Emmys. I mean, that's oh, has, he has won Emmys. He's won at yeah, least yeah. one for this. I think. I think on the first season here, as I recall, he and Winkler both won. I don't think they won the second season because I think that's when Ted Lasso started taking everything. Okay. I could be wrong, um, but I feel like that there. Oh, was so this a, is a, they had this entered as a comedy. Yeah, yeah. This is this okay, is the comedy okay. category, right? Well, yeah. If this if this is being entered as a comedy, I can see the sweeping because it's right. It's well done. It's very but well yeah, done. but I, I think Ted Lasso's kind of stolen some of the thunder. Understandably, Ted Lasso. That's a, a much show more traditional too. comedy, right? Very much so. So I think they lost some of the thunder with that. I could be wrong. There might be a year off in there, but sure. I I I think they won in the first year. They've been nominated again, but I don't know that they won. When did this past the first one? Is this twenty eighteen? 
I'm not sure. Let us know in the comments. Right, I'm, I'm not sure, sure you guys this. Are much more knowledgeable than we right, are. Right, we're but... starting season four here, so 2018, 2019 is probably about right. But um, this is a hell of a premiere. I mean, yeah. yeah it, it's talk about like what you want from a pilot. It introduces conflict. And right. it leaves you wanting more. And, and and it gives you all of the tones and colors you're going to see in the show. This yeah. show is going to be violent. This show is going to be dramatic. And the show is going to be funny. And we're <laughs> going to give you all of that in the first episode so you know what you're looking forward to as you're going forward. It's really good. In 30 minutes. In 30 minutes. Um, and we got a lot of character introductions. I'm, I'm guessing we're getting, with like a lot of the other actors we only got like at the bar scene, mm -hmm. I'm guessing we're going to get more of them as the show goes on, you know, a little bit. Oh, yeah. Because <laughs> I feel like that's going to be a lot of the supporting cast or the other actors. Look, if the show is just them doing doing shitty monologues i'm sorry uh, monologues from uh from movies from the 90s bad and doing them badly <laughs> i'm here for it i'm right. completely here for like that. just just yeah just take all these you know these uh brilliant scenes that are done by brilliant actors and then try to emulate them on a on a stage with 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 lesser actors I, i'm all for it i i want to see one of these guys try to do daniel day lewis and there will be blood <laughs> oh my God. i want him to, i want, want him to do the i'm an oil man speech piece, that starts yeah. it. I want to see what Barry's scene's going to be. Right? Yeah, exactly. Honestly, I don't, Barry doesn't strike me as a guy who watches much TV. He knew what True Romance was, so... But. Yeah, he didn't know what True Romance was, and that's exactly what it was. Oh, that was so funny. That was a great episode, guys. All right, guys, we'll catch you in the next one. See ya.